What's going on guys? Joe with OMGRC.com. Welcome, welcome. So today we're going to be taking pre-orders on the Savage XL. It's a 1.8 scale. I'm going to jump right into it. So if we go over to pre-orders, but you guys want to know when this thing might be coming out. I was told somewhere between April and May of 2022. So this year. So hopefully we'll see it around that time frame. So let's go ahead. I'll put links down in the description below. But for now, if you just head over to our website, as you see, omgrc.com, click on pre-orders, you'll be able to see that Savage XL. So I did a little digging and searching and stuff like that because I was like, not real familiar on all the different uh, vehicles and everything like that. But I wanted to kind of look at these two as far as like the Savage X and the Savage XL. Both of these are new vehicles compared to the previous ones. They've made some changes and things like that. And I kind of want to look over those changes and see if I was buying one, what would I be looking at? So if you're looking at the Savage XL as far as this version two, then there are definitely changes that have been made. And here, just at the very top, I've listed it, showing you all those different changes to it. Now, if you have like a Savage X, which uh, is just a little bit smaller, I have it down at the very bottom and I'll show you. It, there's not a big difference between uh, the length and it seems the width to be the same and the height. There's really not a big difference on that part of it. But I was looking at a picture they showed and it was definitely like deceiving. I thought the vehicle was a lot bigger and I'm like, why is it still 1.8 scale? So that's that. But as far as in regards to the vehicle itself, you know, we can see that uh, the center differential, it has one where the X does not. But if I look at it, I'm gonna go ahead and jump over to just HPI's website and we can see this is the Savage X. It does not have a center differential, which is just a solid spool, which not so great for a bashing vehicle. It puts a lot of stress on that center drive line, especially when you're coming down on the front wheels and it just shocks the rear, basically hurting the center differential where it could break it. So not sure why they never did that. But if by chance you do have a Savage X, well, looking at the two, looks to be exactly the same. You could put that center differential from that XL. So as of right now, I'm not 100% sure, but by looking at it, it looks like why wouldn't it fit, right? Motor mount being the same, things of that nature. So cool, cool. Um, wanted to kind of show you guys, like I'm going to say, you guys can look at this thing at your own leisure and kind of check it all out and form your own opinion. But when I saw this picture too, I was like, dang, that, this Savage XL is definitely a lot bigger. I was like, man. But then uh, I was looking at it online. I seen if anybody else posted or if maybe they had another one of these vehicles out in the wild and maybe a comparison or something like that so I could really kind of visually see the difference between them. Because I know and sometimes, you know, there, you can see this one is up higher and things and it just sets it, makes it look like it's bigger. But if I go down to the very bottom of the page, and I did this just for you guys as far as just to kind of look, uh, it's just a compared to the Savage X. So we can see here, this is the XL above, and this is the XL above, and then the X down below. Just to kind of give you guys like, hey, you know, how much bigger is this vehicle compared to, you know, my Savage X? There you go. As far as those two, you can kind of break that all down. But so it's a little bit bigger, a little bit longer on that part of it. Wider, it's not. It's exactly the same width. And the height, just barely you know, four millimeters taller kind of deal. Um, so, you know, all that good stuff or not <laughs> as far as though, check it all out, but I want to let you guys know in regards to it. So definitely check us out at omgrc.com. Shop for all different hobby RC stuff besides just, uh, you know, what I'm showing you guys here. Definitely uh, it helps support, pays the bills and things like that. So appreciate it guys. And um, again, this thing won't drop out. It'll drop sometime around in, April, May is what I've been told as of right now. So yeah, man, check it out. And uh, we use Klarna, so it's a payment option, so you kind of break it down so it's not so expensive. So if you're looking for one and this is what you've been looking for, you've been looking for that version two to come out, there it is for you guys. So not to discourage anyone, I just want to throw some facts out there. It's nothing's hidden, anything like that. So appreciate you guys, and we'll catch you on the next video. So later.